already. Yeah, for Casey and Dominic, yeah. they've talked about it as a game of missed opportunity. So I just wonder what you guys think about that as two could make on the loss. Yeah, you know, uh, we had a lot of runners in scoring position. Um, you know, their pitchers did a good job, made good pitches, and, uh, you know, we didn't get it done. What did he throw you in the double play ball? Just some, I guess, or the um, inning with the, uh, when that bases were loaded and ground out? I didn't hit a double play. Huh? That was me. Oh, I'm threw me a, no, you're good. Uh, threw me a curveball kind of backside. It's a good pitch. Connor, how'd you feel your outing went? Oh, well, I struggled in some innings, just getting behind on, on some of the batters. But once I figured that out and got ahead, it uh, went well. What's the difference in you at home versus away? I mean, obviously, we have the crowd here. That, that helps. I mean, when you're at home and you got an environment like we have, that, that definitely gives you some confidence to go out there. But, I mean, I felt good last week, too. Just they put the bat on the ball. And, you know, I think it translated this week. What, I put some good work in this week and came out and performed. Casey, how do you feel that uh, Connor did that? I mean, he did great. There's really no difference between him here and him on the road. He's He's been solid um, this past couple outings, definitely. Um, he's hitting his spots today, using all his pitches the right way, and that's what it does. What did you see from your position, Casey, on the home run that, that gave LC Blue? Um, fastball kind of up and middle. Um, kid just threw his hands to it, caught a little barrel, caught a lot of wind, went over the fence. Uh, Scroggins, for, for Connor and Casey, Scroggins got into some trouble, but then there were a couple of innings where he was able to pitch out of it. I wonder what you thought about what he did in, in those innings. Uh, I mean, his stuff was working really good. He was really liking his slider to the righties, and um, he was able to mix his pitches a lot. Sometimes he lost a little control, and that's what led to some of the walks, but... He did really good that if he got into trouble, he would execute and make pitches and get out of it. Yeah, definitely. I just think when he got into trouble, he locked down and made pitches that he needed to make and, you know, was keeping him off balance. Okay, so the fourth, fifth, and sixth, you guys had fourth and fifth, two on, nobody out, you know, and then the sixth, you guys had bases. Like just those situations and not being able to capitalize on those. I mean, it's huge. You gotta, you gotta execute in those situations, especially in the SEC against a team like that. That um, game can flip any moment. You gotta put as many runs up on the board as you can, and that they give to you. And uh, I personally did a terrible job at it today, and just gotta move on, be better next time. You seem to hurt today. I mean, you look, you get two out of three from them after you know after last few series. You feel on, on the whole, still a good weekend. Yeah, of course. Anytime you. Uh, Take two out of three from a team, win a series in a SC weekend. It's a good weekend. So uh, ultimately, that's what it comes down to. We won the series, and uh, you know we're moving on to A and M. For you, did it feel good to finally uh, take a series from LSU? Yeah, um, you know that was my first series win against LSU in three years. Um, you know, obviously it's huge. Uh, we'd like to beat those guys every time we play them. So. Um, just for you personally, what was working at the plate this weekend? Um, you know, just kind of laying off some pitches uh, I might have been swinging at maybe the past weekend. Um, really sticking to my approach, trying to, you know, get something out over the plate um, and just put my barrel on it in the middle of the field. Their home run ball from where you were watching, did it look like that was a potentially spectacularly catchable ball, or how did it look to you? Yeah, I, you know, on a normal day, that ball is probably caught on the warning track. Uh, it got up in the air pretty high. The wind started blowing out, and it took it an extra 20 feet and just got over Heston's glove. I know Coach talks a lot about each loss counts the same, but I wonder if this one feel a little bit different given where you guys are in the standings and, and what you might have been able to do as you held on. Not really. Um, you know, I think the big thing is we won the series. Um, you know, it's just another game, and, uh, you know, we're ready to move on to A&M.